I remember actually like I had to, I had to take a, a leave because I was so mentally exhausted and overwhelmed. And, you know, you talked about your principal. I had a principal very similar, just was awesome and just incredible. And I didn't want to take the leave. It was like, um, there was a, a, like a stubbornness about it. And she said, you're not, you're not okay. Like you need, just take some time and you know, you'll be fine. And we will like, we'll, we'll be able to cover you. Don't worry about it. But like, you are not okay right now. And I felt, and like, when I look back at that and I actually remember writing about it, I, it was, I had given everything in education to everyone else. And then I had nothing left for me. And to the point where I, I just was exhausted and I couldn't do it anymore. And I, I feel that sometimes like the stuff that we're talking about right now is people will listen to this is like, oh, this kind of sounds selfish. I'm like, it's actually a little selfless in the sense that you better prepare yourself to, like, I find I have more energy to help others when I make sure that I carve out mm -hmm. time for myself. Would you say yes. that's, do you feel that same oh, way? Like, 100% like true. 100% true. You have to take care of yourself. And it goes back to living that balanced life too. And sometimes in our balanced life, we have to tell people no, because yep. it's protecting our own mental health. Um, but absolutely. I agree with that. So I got to do something for this, for you saying, you gotta learn to say no. <laughs> I love it because that is, that is the, the biggest weakness of many educators, including myself is mm -hmm. you, you often say no to everyone else or you say no or yes to everyone else. And then no to yourself. And then it comes back to haunt you. And then, and then we kind of get in a situation where we can't actually help anyone. So that's why I wanted to have you on the podcast, because I think this is so crucial and you know, you're doing this teaching full time, <laughs> having kids and you know, you're making it work and not only are you doing this, but you're inspiring people like myself to, you Thank know, you. keep this too. So